Morning, peeps. Let's read. This is written by Diane Neal Matthews. The verse for today is 2 Corinthians 5, 17. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has passed away. Behold, the new has come. While reorganizing my office, I found my name tag from the first writing conference I attended. I picked it up and remembered how I'd covered it with my notebook whenever I got near the editor who had been assigned to evaluate the manuscript I'd submitted. Up until that day, an inner voice whispered to me, when he reads it, he'll wonder why you even came to a writer's conference. You don't belong here. If these people knew you and zero write, had zero writing talent, they would kick you out. More than 20 years later, I still hear that nagging voice sometimes. I think most of us struggle with circumstances, places, or people that make us feel as that we don't measure up. Our insecurities can make us afraid to let others see who we truly are. Self-doubt can cause us to miss wonderful opportunities that God intends for us. That's why I need to focus on who Jesus says I am. Once I became a new creation in Christ, he gave me a new identity based on his sacrifice for me. Now I'm God's adopted child, accepted and unconditionally loved, even though I fail miserably. Regardless of what other people think about me or how I feel about myself on any given day, Jesus has written a new set of name tags for me. Forgiven, free, beloved, esteemed. There's never any need to cover those up. I thought that was very good because I, I too struggle with my self-esteem, you know, like, I don't look. I'm doing the best I can, really. I know it's cronky, but... So, it resonated very well with me, and she did a good job. So, I thought I would share it. So, remember, you are forgiven. You are esteemed. You are free. You are beloved. Keep that in mind. I got my book, peeps. Good morning, Heavenly Father. We're so grateful that we are your adopted child and that you care enough for us to send your son to cover all of our sins and that we can move on i'm lifting up my peeps lord the ones in the book and the ones that aren't in the book they too need your forgiveness and love and being covered by jesus sins so i'm requesting that for them all this i pray in jesus name amen that's it peeps i hope this finds you absolutely amazing stay blessed until next time Hey, you made it to the end. Please hit like and subscribe and thanks for watching.